survey questionnaires chatbot so let's see how to qualify your leads and add lead scores easily to your chatbot contacts so first of all i will show a demo of how this actually works and after that i will explain how this actually built so without any further ado let's uh, start with the demo over here so let me share my phone screen over here so here we are in the instagram dms over here so let me trigger the questionnaire chatbot using this particular kind of keyword over here so it should start the chatbot so it says welcome to chatting media please tap the button below to start your project so if i tap on this button let's go it will simply start the uh, questionnaire chatbot or in other words a lead qualification chatbot so it says what is the main goal of your project so the customers can choose a support sales both or no idea so let me choose both over here and after that it will simply goes to the next question next question is that uh, do you need integration with existing systems so let me press yes over here and what is your budget range for the project 1k to 3k less than 1k or 3k plus so let me choose uh, 3k plus over here and see what happens so we actually have only these three questions thank you for taking time to complete our a chatbot project qualification questionnaire and it says a dual lead score is five and it has actually suggest this particular person to book a free strategy session so this actually happens due to the lead score over here so let me explain what is happening in the back end over here so first of all uh, this flow the questionnaire flow is triggered uh, using the keyword q1 over here so the q1 over here it is triggered using this automated response so when someone send a q1 use a message q1 we will send this particular flow so the flow looks like this one so we have this flow questionnaire start flow and it says welcome to chatting media please tap the button below to start your project and when someone tap on this button let's go we actually start an action to start the questionnaire so this particular action is added using our plus point and actions over here and here you can simply choose whatever the questionnaire over here uh, you want to start so here if you scroll down here you have the option to choose questionnaire and all the questionnaire will be listed over here and there are other options as well you can even end the questionnaire over here as well so here you can actually start the questionnaire over here so that's how this actually started so you might be wondering how this questionnaire is set up over here so to set up the questionnaire we have this questionnaire tool over here so if you go to tools and scroll down over here to questionnaires and it says quickly conduct surveys quizzes with a real time feedback on results so let me go over here so as you know we actually go through this particular questionnaire and there is only one applicant so what we can do is we can actually check the applicants uh, details as well so if i choose applicants over here it should say the test charity media so this is the instagram account we tested and i actually got five points so here if i scroll down uh, the lead score is five points and if you tap on this button it simply show all the answers so by answering both i got two points over here by uh, you do you need integrations i said yes for that i got one point and also the for the budget rate i choose 3k plus and here i got two points so you can also easily go to the inbox from here and check the particular uh, chat as well so here this is the particular person's account test chatting media instagram account and here you can check all the chat and you can also ch check those variables asked in the particular kind of questionnaire in the particular profile variable as well so here lead score 5 need integration yes project budget and the project goal so everything is listed here and a particular agent can simply chat with this particular customer to nurture or qualify them further as well so that is how this whole thing work now let's me let me explain how to set up uh, this particular questionnaire over here so let me go back to questionnaires over here so creating the question is very easy you can simply add new questionnaire so let me open the particular questionnaire we have over here so as you remember uh, we actually have uh, three kind of questions main goal of your project uh, integrations and also about the project budget so we only have three questions so here question one is multiple choice because we actually provided these three options for the customers uh, support sales both no idea those kind of things and based on these answers for example if someone choose uh, support we actually add one point for them if someone choose sales we add one point and if if someone choose both we actually add two points and here the next question 
do you need integration with existing systems and likewise we actually choose multiple choice and if someone says yes we actually add one points and the final question is what is your project budget and here we have these three options if you want you can simply add new options over here as well and based on these answers if someone choose like 3k plus we actually add two points if it is less than 1k we uh, we actually not adding any points it says zero and likewise you can also save uh, these questions uh, responses for example what is your budget range for this uh, project and we are actually saving this particular response from the customer into this particular custom field over here so likewise a uh, do you need integration is saved into the custom field name as a uh, need integration and likewise uh, what is the main goal of your project it's also saved in the project goal uh, custom field so that's why when we check the inbox over here we are able to easily locate uh, those customers are uh, details or custom fields over here so that's why they're so easily located because and also uh, trigger the flow by completing the questionnaire so when the questionnaire is completed so let's say here we have only three questions once all these three questions are answered we can actually set which flow to trigger so here we have chosen the questionnaire end flow so uh, i will explain what is uh, in this particular questionnaire and flow and also uh, we, you can actually if you want to uh, add points like this you have to choose this option and also if you want to customize a retry messages you can simply choose this so retry message if the reply is invalid you can actually choose whatever the message you want and also save data to custom fields so likewise if you want to get this kind of data within the inbox profile uh, you can actually simply save those responses into these custom fields as well so we have actually chosen all these options here so now let's look at the questionnaire end field over here so here if i go to the questionnaire end field it actually start with this particular kind of custom field so here we have this number custom field known as a lead score so you can create your own custom field and we are actually using this system fields last points which actually captures uh, the total number of questionnaire points for a particular customer so in this case once a particular a particular customer goes through this particular questionnaire we actually assign the points as well based on the answers to each of these uh, questions so let me show so here this particular person got five points so we can actually capture this as a variable and save it in our own variable over here let's go and here once the question is finished we actually send this kind of message so let me show thank you for taking time to complete our chatbot project qualification questionnaire and here we say the lead score so your lead score is this particular kind of lead score and based on the lead score we can actually customize the messages so in this case my lead score is greater than two so here we have a condition to check if the lead score is greater than two we actually ask those kind of customers to schedule a free strategy session so if the lead score is less than two or less than or equal to two in this case we simply suggest them to uh, our ai chatbot build a platform so that means we actually suggest them to build their own chatbots by using our ai chatbot platform so in this case as you already remember we actually uh, got a lead score 5 that's why we actually asked to schedule a free strategy so if i go through this particular chatbot flow again or this particular questionnaire again and get a score let's score less than two or those kind of things in this case i will be asked to uh, this kind of a message will be sent so i can show it real quick as well so here we are doing this quiz again real quick so here i'm going to make sure i get less than two points so let me press no idea and let me press no over here and uh, this time let me choose uh, 1k to 3k so i believe i will get a lead score one over here so as you see lead score one so since the lead score is less than two so less than two that is one so that's why it is simply asked the customer to start building your own chatbots uh, with our no code a chatbot builder and if they click on this button it will take uh, them to our platform website which actually explain all the features about our chatbot builder over here so that's how you can actually easily build survey questionnaire chatbots to qualify and nurture your leads easily thank you